Hello, this is Buona from Buona.tv and today I want to talk about Sweet Cron. Sweet Cron is the automated live stream blog software. Now, what is live streaming? Live streaming is a topic that's pretty hot in the blogosphere today, Web 2.0 world. And it consists of uh, aggregating your social web life. Uh, for example, if you're on Twitter, you're on Jaiku, you're on all these social networks, you're on Facebook, you're on Flickr, you know, you're on Rejaw, all these different networks you've heard me talk about, but you want to uh, basically aggregate all of that information into one website. The term for that is now called live streaming, so that people can go to one spot to see what you're doing all over the web. Sweetcron launched a few days ago, and what made it so attractive, excuse me, what made it so attractive to a lot of people was that it was visual. It wasn't just text. It wasn't just you know icons with updates and things like that but it supports these certain features automatic imports so what that means is that you can set up your feeds uh, for instance your Flickr, your Twitter, your uh, Identica whatever RSS feed you want and Sweetcron will automatically import it on a periodic basis by default it'll go for every 30 minutes but you can set it up to be whatever you want easily customizable uh, it comes with two themes a sandbox and a box theme but uh, it's pretty much all HTML slash CSS so if you know those two languages in terms of uh, web hosting I'm sorry in terms of web pages and things like that you'll be able to customize it pretty easily self-hosted it runs on your web host so you don't need to uh, sign up for anything you have to install the software yourself and a lot of people were kind of deterred by that when they first heard about it, they were like, okay, where do I sign up for the beta? Or what's the invite code? You know, the typical Web 2.0 mantra. But uh, <laughs> you have to actually have your own host. And if you're familiar with installing software packages like WordPress or, uh, or Movable Type or anything like that, then you know about self-hosting. It's free and open source, and it's now in public beta. And you can download it today. So what I've done over at livestream.buana.org is that I have set up Sweetcron and you can see I'm using what's called the box theme so every one of my updates is in a box and uh, by default if you install Sweetcron you're gonna see things um, you're gonna see your updates look a certain way what I've done is I've customized this to match what particular services I use so it's heavily not heavily customized but I pretty much changed the way every box looked but I kept this box theme because it was very visual and it gave me a uh, you know it's, it's pleasing to the eyes if I were to come to some ice site and look at this I can go okay you know this is something I, I would want to check every every so often so as you can see my status updates are from Identica so what I've done is I've taken the color scheme from Identica the background and I use it for that and I have my little icon up here and what I'm saying also I've customized my Google Reader shared items and they have like a Google Reader background and I have a little RSS icon and it tells you what I'm sharing also to the right over here let me scroll up I have my my <laughs> avatar and a little a little um, intro message and some tags and I also have installed Intense Debate. This is a commenting system, very popular one that's uh, that rivals Discus or Discuss, however you want to pronounce it. People pronounce it Discuss because you're discussing things, but I like to say Discus because I want to be mean. Anyway, I installed Intense Debate, and uh, you can install these commenting systems with that so that when people go to these blog posts, I'm going to click on one of these here it goes to a dedicated page and in the comments section you can have comments and uh, you can manage these comments with these commenting systems so the primary services I have with, with mine are Redraw, Identica, Google Reader, Shared Items and let's see here let's go to page two see if I see something different I know I have uh, last.fm loved items and not recently played items but loved items there's a Yahoo pipe available for that if you want it just let me know and I will send it um, what else I think I have about 10 to 12 services but those are the main ones that I update on a regular basis so if you come over to livestream.buana.org those are the ones you're probably gonna see the most of Identica, Google Reader, Shared Items and Rejaw uh, and if I post some Flickr pictures or some picture pictures that's another service I use picture okay there are some um, there's some loved tracks there 
So as you can see, they, they kind of look different. I, I I took the default theme and I added my own backgrounds and I did my own customizations. And if, if you spend about an hour and a half with it, I think you'll get the hang of it. Just got to be patient and uh, learn how to use it um, and learn the quirks. Now, the development community is growing, and I want to talk about that now. There's a site called SweetCronThemes.com, which is very easy on the eyes. Uh, currently, they have one theme called Plain and Simple. But uh, I've been following the Sweet Cron Room on FriendFeed. I uh, highly recommend you check it out. It's uh, friendfeed.com slash room slash Sweet Cron, and there's discussions going on here. And I found, uh, let's see, three themes that I want to show you. The first one is called, I forgot what it's called. I'm just going to show you these. This one has like a burned paper look, and I, I really like how it looks. And uh, I don't know if it's out yet, but I am going to be watching that one very closely. This is another one. This one's very easy on the eyes as well. So as you can see, it's very visual. It's not, you know, it's not texty. You know, it's, you can just glance at it and know where it's coming from. Like this big flicker uh, picture here and this big fail well from Twitter, you know, and this, you know, quick icon. So it's very easy on the eyes. And finally, uh, here's a, a simple green theme. So it's, you know, it's all about styling around these updates. And I think it's uh, actually going to take off pretty well now this is what the code looks like I have here uh, my activity feed PHP and uh, as you can see if you understand HTML it's not very hard to do like for this case it's just a bunch of if statements if my feed is friend feed then do something if my feed is Google Reader shared items then do something else you know to have different styles and classes in uh, within SweetCron so that you can style your own themes but if you want to go with these preset themes that I've shown you like I said they're really nice and I highly encourage you to get involved so the site is sweetcron.com go check it out and uh, you can have your own automated live stream blog software now if you're kind of deterred about the self hosting part I have seen people on the mailing list from different host providers who are looking for a hosted solution so look for this to come on your hosted uh, on your hosted site if you're on a hosted site if you don't want to install it or look for some somebody might start a free service with with some advertisements around it that might not be a bad idea all right this is Buana from Buana.tv and that's the sweet cron baby